It's time now for some quick fire around the nation. Officials in Cyprus have found another body in the serial murder cases against Army Captain Nikos Metaxas. The investigators recovered a suitcase from a toxic lake, and the suitcase contained human remains. The suspect has earlier confessed to killing five women and two girls. Three of the victims are Filipino women, including Mary Rose Tiburcio and Arian Palanas Lozano. One of the girls murdered was the child of one of the Filipinas, and Metaxas said that he placed the bodies of three of his victims in suitcases before throwing them into the lake. And the Philippine Institute of Volcanology and Seismology, or FIVOLCS, raises Alert Level 1 over Mount Bulusan in Sorsogon. This was due to an increase in the seismic activity around the volcano. Between May 4 and May 5, the agency tallied 16 volcanic earthquakes. Residents are being told to avoid entering the 4-kilometer radius, also called the Permanent Danger Zone. And just when the country is still recovering from the back-to-back -back earthquakes last April, a 5.8 magnitude quake has hit Pagudpud, Ilocos Norte as of 10.48 a.m. today. The earthquake was felt at a moderately strong intensity 4 in Pasukin, Ilocos Norte and Tugigarao City. T-Volks warned that the quake may spawn aftershocks, but assured the public that it won't cause any major damage to property. And former House Speaker Prospero Nograles has passed away yesterday. His son, Cabinet Secretary and former Davao Congressman Carlo Nograles broke the news. The late speaker was 71 and he served 15 years in public service. Officials of the government, including President Duterte, visited Nograles' wake in Taguig. His family will fly his remains to Davao tomorrow.